All right, the adventure begins. Welcome aboard Finnair's A330, which is going to take us down to Doha today. And of course, if you've been following along on social media, you'll know that this is the beginning of the big adventure to Africa, specifically Zimbabwe, to fly the last truly passenger configured, commercially operating 737-200. But on the way, we've managed to find some fun to have and some interesting things to see, because we're going to be on this A330, mostly in the flight deck, heading down to Doha. And if you haven't seen our Finnair A350 flight deck video, I'll put a link up here and uh, you should definitely check that out. Our most popular video to date I was joking with the captain just now that uh, he wants to try and top that. We're not going to the North Pole, so it might be tough, but who knows, maybe Doha draws a good crowd too, I hope so. So we're gonna take a little look at the cabin in the A330. You'll have seen it also in the New York flight that I did when this cabin was quite new. We took a flight out to New York from Stockholm and back and reviewed this thing properly. So we'll, we'll put some links to those in too. We've done a lot with Finnair. It's always nice to be back with Finnair. So let's take a look at the cabin and then we're gonna jump into the flight deck, sit in the jump seat. Apologies. incredibly comfortable seat as we know from all my previous flights on it. The A330 is a little less spacious than the A350 but I think it's still a really beautiful cabin and uh, plenty of feeling of both airiness and also kind of luxurious privacy so it's a good mix. Thank you and Kevin Crew please be ready for safety demonstration. You may recall from the North Pole video that Finnair doesn't allow any filming in the cockpit below 10,000 feet. It's a shame because we miss some fun views, but it is what it is. And up here, following the rules always comes first. I mounted a GoPro to my window in the business cabin so you can watch the takeoff on this beautiful late spring day out of Stockholm. This is uh, kind of a very uh, regular rule what we have on once we fly to uh, fly to Doha. So it take us first through the uh, the uh, the Baltic Sea and then then to Poland and then uh, here to the Slovakia and then these these countries to eventually to Black Sea and then across uh, northern parts of Turkey. We uh, we go to uh, Iran and 
you start to have in this region you have some higher um, altitude here so it's something where we uh, have to uh, be, be mindful because there's some uh, procedures if in, in case of decompression and or emergency descent so but we have it and then across uh, across Iran and then, then we have the uh, Arabic Sea and takes us to, to Doha so estimate flight time six hours and uh, uh, 22 minutes. Qatar Airways has a lot of uh, lot of operations, daily operations, so on uh, to, to various destinations. So it is a busy airport indeed. It is quite busy yes. airport. Plenty, plenty of traffic here. Yes. Mostly what I experienced here is there's not that 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 much holding or something, but sometimes it. The arrival routes are quite long, but otherwise it's it's very uh, nice and smooth. The airport, everything goes very very smoothly there. What I've been when I've been flying there, so quite quite nice. I, I like the destination. It's uh, compared mostly I do the long haul flights, and they, they always have some uh, time difference, so uh, that that uh, makes them more more tiring in a way because you miss miss half a night. So it's, in that way, this is nice nice change for the for the missing nights and, and don't, don't have a big time difference. This flight is good because you fly at the daytime. Usually you fly, always the flights are a bit of the night, so it's yeah. easier like that. We then go up in after 4, 5, 0, 9. Do you also fly at 350 or just... Like yeah, I fly also 350. Thomas also flies 350 and uh, it's a uh, more, more, more modern plane than this one on the avionics. So, uh, okay. And it's also... Uh, Kind of like more uh, more open and more space, so it's it's a uh, you can see this is a uh, 350s uh, next generation airplane and my, my opinion the the best aircraft I flew almost uh, convenient it's it's a it's a fantastic environment to work because it's uh, it's a functional and you have space and and uh, it's magnificent I, I have to I, I enjoy it I like it but of course the, this one is good also yeah yeah it's nice. <laughs> we like it. The usual nice list of Finnair drinks. We're flying over Poland, uh, just to the northeast of Krakow. We came back to the seat to just have a little bit of dinner and uh, hang out a bit. So now we can taste some of this food. It's called burnt beef. I don't know what that is exactly, but it sounds delicious. And it's a kind of slow cooked beef. Delicious. Looks like a little bit of uh, gratin, potatoes and carrots. Nice, nice bunch of vegetables. Really good. Northern brush. Yeah. I'll try to stick to just having one. Cause we're working. exception is on the A350 because it's so quiet it grooves. If someone's making a lot of noise, you notice it. But there's something about these suites that they kind of dampen the noise and make you feel like you're in this little cocoon and when the cabin's darkened and like in between service times, in between meal times, it just feels like you're by yourself up here. It's strange and quite nice. It's a nice old plane, the A330. Can't fall.
I'm in the galley right now. It's kind of quiet, middle of the flight, nothing much going on. And uh, Jenny was kind enough to say that she would she would appear in the video. It's always fun to talk to other airline employees than just the pilots up front, right? So uh, you're a flight attendant on this flight? Yeah. Based in Sweden? Exactly. Stockholm. Okay. Based. So you're doing all these, these Doha flights now? Only Doha for now. I did New York and Los Angeles last year. They changed, so okay. only Doha. Yeah, so when they were doing those new, those US flights, you did those? Yeah. And then switched over to these? Exactly. And how are these flights to work? How's this one in particular? It seems like a pretty quiet... Yeah, this is super easy. It's not a full... I work in business today, and uh, it's, uh, it's not a full... So it's uh, quiet, and everyone is sleeping right now. It's are you getting to know Doha now? You've done a bunch of them? Uh, I've done a couple, but I'm eager to explore more. Okay, yeah. cool. Nice. Are you gonna stay in the No, I gotta go. I'm, I'm continuing tonight to Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe. Yeah. That's interesting. Yeah, it's just fun for sure. Yeah. Um, anyway, so you can go follow. You're on TikTok, right? Yeah. Go okay. follow her on TikTok. I'll put a, a link to the profile maybe in the, in the description. Yeah. That's nice. All right. So after dinner, I had a little rest. Now we're over Iran, Iraq, out to our right-hand side, and uh, Kuwait City coming up soon. Maybe let's see if we can head back into the flight deck and see what's happening up there. In Iran. Okay. And now we have to check the maps for the oxygen escape routes. And now, uh, well, we are now uh, being a point Radit, which is here. So right now we are on a segment so that if there would be some kind of problems, we would fly to Hubei. Okay, and, yeah. And this map shows the uh, the altitudes we have to maintain so that we can be out of the high terrain. Mm -hmm. Getting near to Doha. Not far away anymore. Yeah. We are there in Doha, I see. 902, what do you think? Start the descent in Nebuchadnezzar will be 40. Uh, some 30, 37, 38. Maybe you start descending there. One hour, 15 minutes maybe. Okay. Yeah. I noticed there was a Qatar 8350 behind us that was passing us and ah, yeah, arrived yes, 12, yes. Minutes, ah, okay. 12 minutes earlier. Yes, yeah, I was a little yeah. bit jealous of Yes, the yes, speed. they're actually they're, they're faster, it flies faster than the uh, 350, quite yeah. a significant uh, difference on the on the cruising speed with the 350. Cruising altitudes are higher higher compared to 3 uh, 330. So it's, uh, it yeah. is a it is a good wing. Over Iran, things start to get busier, and it's incredible to listen to air traffic control as we enter the approach to Doha alongside dozens of other aircraft. They use three, three, four right and left, but normally it's the, the right where we, yeah, I have landed at least most results. Clear and flight number one, request to Matwell 410 for cruise. We have also uh, Good uh, briefing material from the local airports, and then you can also see the most common um, arrival routes what we we normally receive. So it helps a little bit of us to uh, prepare how how uh, how many track miles we get during the descent and what we expect. Sort of briefing material based on what normally goes on there and how the how the experience of the airport. So it always especially helps if you go in a new airport where you haven't been before, so you can look from the. Uh, Briefing material, what, what we might expect at this time. So we have the uh, ground map there for the for the mountains. So it was just taxiway, uh, channel between taxiway Sierra, Echo 4 closed. So 
Tower on Hello, good star 499 and heavy, flight level 390. Okay, four nine 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 n
Please are uh, 10 and 4, Kilo C270 Senior 4, Kilo, Kinder Doha 1, 1, this is all 1, goodbye. Doha 1, 1, 1, Kinder 4, Kinder 1. Control 973, pass the free follow, 220 or 210, free speed. Getting uh, Doha, Kinder uh, 4, Kilo, Kinder 4, 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 Thirteen thousand unrestricted on QNH one zero zero six. Four Kilometer. Can't be seven three descent flight level one five zero unrestricted. One five zero unrestricted ninety seven three. Sorry three four Quebec descent uh, flight level one six zero unrestricted. Descent flight level one six zero unrestricted. Qatari three four Quebec. Sorry, uh, 6 uh, one Bravo, descent flight level uh, 2 one zero, unrestricted. Sorry, 6 two, one, zero, good night, 6 one, Bravo. Sorry, 6 Bravo, descent flight level 1 at 5 0. Descent flight level 1 5 0, Qatari, Sorry, 6 Bravo, descent flight level 1 at 5 0. Descent flight level 1 5 0, Qatari, Good uh, evening, Qatari. 15 X-ray, flight level 210 with a speed of 300. Uh, Finnair 5, Tango Papa, right turn direct to Lubak. Sorry, 3 4 Quebec, right turn direct Lubak. Right turn direct uh, Lubak, Qatari 3 4 Quebec. Descent uh, flight level uh, so, 200. Qatar Airways, so they, Descent uh, flight level 200, uh, and restricted Qatari 031. Turn uh, direct right, so they get a shortcut here. Really, really nice shortcut. 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 One two four seven seven five in air four kilo. Final. In air four kilo. Uh, thank you. Uh, you continue as clear. Descend one one eleven thousand feet. That is clear. Descend down to one one thousand feet in air four kilo. In air five single pop. Uh, traffic go past uh, just off your right hand side, slightly behind seven thirty seven max, a thousand feet below. I've been to five single pop. Thanks for information. We have a little more tea, guys. Sorry, 3-4 Quebec, you said 9 or 1,000 feet. Hello, 1-1, I said 3-2-4, traffic on the right side. Uh, traffic is no factor, climb to 8,000 feet. 1-1, I said 3-2-4 now. Sorry, 3-4, you can route direct to Cupro. Route direct to Cupro, 1-1, I said 3-2-4. Enter 5, single pop, at decent 6,000 feet, please, and contact director 1194. Decent 6,000 feet, and contact 1194, Finner, 5, single pop, good day. Thing of sorry, three, three, four. Additional traffic off your left-hand side is a uh, sorry, triple seven, descending a thousand feet above caution wake turbulence. Climbing at thousand feet, three, three, four. Thank you. Center four kilo, descend unrestricted nine or thousand feet. Descent out nine thousand feet, or four kilo. Thing of sorry, three, three, four. Are you able to speed two seven zero knots or greater? Able, able, bang, I said 324. Thank you, speed 270 or greater, I'll hop higher for you shortly. I said 324. Sorry, 6-1, Bravo, route direct to Kipik, descend unrestricted 8,000 feet. 2-2-7-0, descend 8,000 feet, 2-2-7-0, Bravo. Alright, 3-4, Quebec, contact director, 1-1-9-4, bye-bye. 5-4, Qatar, 3-4, Quebec, thank you, bye-bye. 4 Kilo, route direct to Misox, descend unrestricted 6,000 feet. Alright, Misox, descend 6,000 feet, 4 Kilo.
we park right alongside two other company A330s which have just landed from Copenhagen and Helsinki. It's a pretty cool operation Finnair has to Doha now from three Nordic capitals. As ever, it was super fun to watch the pilots do their work, so thanks very much to them for the opportunity. Come back next week for part two of this African adventure series where I'll be headed on Qatar Airways down to Harare in Zimbabwe via Lusaka, Zambia. And we'll take a peek at the brand new Qatar Airways garden lounge and indoor orchard, a welcome green respite from the busyness of Hamad International in the middle of the night. In Doha for Flight Radar 24, I'm Gabriel Lee.